Hey everyone, it is Bruffton here in Mexico City. Beautiful neighborhood, Roma Norte. Today, the big question before us is, can a guy learn how to do a tattoo in one day? We're outside of Nomad, a boutique tattoo parlor. I'm gonna work with the artists, I'm gonna design a tattoo, and I'm going to put that tattoo somewhere on myself. It sounds just as bad as when I think it and when I say it out loud. Can't wait to do it, kinda. <laughs> um, it's a little nuts. Hopefully I won't regret this. We'll find out. My guide for the day would be tattoo artist Halil Abragon. All right, so we're gonna start with the introduction on the materials that you're gonna be using today. I'm gonna give you a quick start on needles and the inks, and I'm gonna show you how to prepare your own station so you can start to tweak yourself, all right? All right, let's get it going. So right here, we have our cartridges that we use. Halil then gave me a crash course on needle types, the number of needles per cartridge, their various sizes, and most frighteningly, their sharpness. That's pretty much it, because they're like really, really sharp needles. All right, we're gonna practice on the fake skin with some different um, cartridges. Halil then brought out some fake skin for me to practice. But before we began, I wanted to show him my design. I wanna show you real quick. Oh, that's My idea for design. So I, I wanna do these three waves, okay? All right. From the temperance oh, okay, okay. card. Supposed to represent balance of unconscious and conscious mind. Yeah, no, that's a perfect design. Yeah? Yeah, I mean, good. Halil approves of the design. Woo! It was then time to sanitize and set up our stations. And then... That's a there it is, there it is. Like this. And then, same thing. I can't get this. There's no way I can be trusted to <laughs> stick a needle full of ink <laughs> on, my, on my arm. Oh, All right, you're almost there though. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Ten times a charm. This is tattoo butter. It smells like berries. Is it or no? Not really. This is the ink we're gonna be using. Twist it and we get as close as we can. Oh sh uh, balls. Ready? I'm ready. I'm ready, here you go. <laughs> Medium ready. Medium ready. Alright. Is the needle. What the machine does is to push this part of plastic. To put it in, you push it and you're gonna lock it to a side. One button. Yeah. Try to just barely touch the ink. You're gonna grab a little butter and then you're gonna put it in here. And spread it out. And as you have, you just try to do like fast. Just, yeah, if you want, just try to do one dot. Stretch the skin and try not to go really deep. Is that not in? I like that. Alright. That's not so bad. And that's in my forever. That's the right depth. That's the right depth. That's the right depth. But keeping it going for a straight line, that's a hard part, alright? Do you have confidence in him? I'm a little bit afraid that like, he's gonna bleed more than I was expecting to, but now that I see him grabbing the machine, probably, yeah, it's gonna look more like a scar than more like an a tattoo, so. What is your biggest fear today? That I will 
cut my skin wide open with a strange, long, inky mark. After I selected my reference image, I texted it to Halil, who then transferred it to his iPad. Halil traced the image, simplifying the design to make it more beginner-friendly, and printed out a stencil for me to trace. I set up my station, cleaned my leg, shaved it, set my guide, and I was ready to go. All right, so I'm gonna do a little butter first. Just a little. Mm, and that's perfect. Though. That's good, okay. Yeah, that's... Is that spread enough? Yeah, but you don't have any ink still. Oh, I don't have any ink. <laughs> You're getting nervous, bro. <laughs> Let's press it. You can go to the three lines first and then clean it and then you can see so how many of those. Just give it away. Oh. oh wow, it's went I did much deeper than I thought. Oh wow. It's already pretty black. Yeah. <laughs> oh wow. Oh my god. It's perfectly imperfect, I'll tell you that. But that's part of it though. I think that I think so too. <laughs> it's not exactly like the drawing. Did I did it? Yeah, you did. As you see, that was what I was a little bit afraid of. Oh, the blood, yeah. Yeah, you went a little bit too deep, though. And from far away, it looks smooth. Can you shave that. your head like a little and kind of close your eyes? <laughs> <laughs> Should I give it one more pass? Or is that asking for it? I'm like, my, my perfectionist in me is just like screaming. I think it looks good. You yeah, think looks I think good? if you do it one more time, it's gonna. All right, know. you know what? This is it. This is it, yeah. This is it. Perfect. 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 It's an ode to first attempts, imperfection, hashtag gonzo. <laughs> Just kidding. Dude, nice Dude, meeting you. Nice meeting real. you. Thank you for everything. Nah, it's been amazing. Yeah. Thanks, thanks for your help, man. I couldn't have done it without you. For real. Appreciate thanks, it. All right, take All right, care. Yeah. No, I mean, I thought, for real, I thought you were gonna cry it yeah. out, though. Yeah. For a moment, I thought you were gonna cry.